Hello and welcome to our candy store. Is there anything I can help you look for today? It's a little bit of everything and something new. Perfect. Well, you're in luck because we have both. So, tell me a little bit about your snack preferences. Do you prefer salty to sweet snacks? Do you like gummies, chocolates, crisps? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. Alright, perfect. Well, that helps me. So, now I can pick out the best products for you. Are you looking for any drink products? Okay, alright. So, how about we start off with a sampler plate? So, this is a sampler plate of some sweet products that we have in our store. You're gonna hear them rustling a little bit. So, you're more than welcome to try anything on this plate. And we sell everything that's on this plate. We have two Haichu samples. One is blue raspberry, one is rainbow sherbet, and they both come in the same pack. This one's the blue raspberry, this one's the rainbow sherbet. Over here we have an assortment of jelly belly beans. Some are from the cocktail collection, and I think some are from the Holiday Favorites collection. Over here we have something called a Sellers Square. Sellers is a very popular brand, but this is a little bit more of a different product from them. This is a milk chocolate cherry infused square. Over here we have some chocolate eggs. These are like a chocolate ganache almost. You'll find an orange, yellow, and blue one. The flavours aren't any different, they're all about the same. And they have a candy coating, a little sharp. Right in the middle here, you'll see we have something called a fruit salad. This is a very popular, old, classic product. This is a pineapple and raspberry infused, chewy, gummy sweet. This is so nice. Perfect. So what I'll do is I'll put this right there for you and you can feel free to sample any of the products off of the plate and if they happen to interest you, we can have a look at the product in greater detail. Okay, perfect. Let's see what we should start with. We are having quite a clearance right now, so are you open to seeing some seasonal products? Okay, perfect. Alright, so let's start with... Start with something off, away from the plate. That way you have time to try them. So this is a German product. You said you're interested in some gummy products. This is by Harry Bob. This is the Fruit Mania collection. So these are squishy, juicy gummies. And these contain a variety of different flavours. And they're quite easily identifiable because of the shapes of the fruits. They all have slightly different colours, textures to them. So that will help guide you to your flavour preference. These are 160 grams. And these contain real fruit juice, including strawberry, raspberry, blackberry, blueberry, and blackcurrant. So these are going to have a nice chewy but easy to chew consistency to them. They're going to be lovely and juicy and a little bit different from your typical more artificial 
fruit candy. So I try and squeeze one. There's a little bit of a squish to the product. So that helps show that it's going to be quite easy to chew. So this comes in a very wonderful, beautiful packaging. All these gorgeous hues, orange and red, in the packet. And it has this red decoration, the purple beneath it. Lots of beautiful illustrations to display exactly what you can try. Sounds good? Great. We take this. Perfect. So I'll let you keep trying some of the samples. You let me know if something interests you. Of course, you don't have to like any of them or ask about any of them. If you like them, great. If you don't, that's fine. That's what our sample plates are for. Here's another one. So this is a seasonal clearance item that we have right now. So this is by Jet Puff. Do you know that company? Yeah, they make marshmallows, yeah. So this is the same thing. I've personally not tried these. This is the Jet Puffed Gummies. And this is the Marshmallow Blue Raspberry flavor. So you get this beautiful rainbow at the front. Very typical of Jet Puffed packaging. And you have a snowman in the corner here. And there's some snowflakes, lots of lovely colours. And right here is an example of two of the products that you'll find inside the box. One is kind of like a snowflake and the other is, I believe, one of the Jet Puffed mascots. So, this weighs in total 85 grams. It's in one of those really nice convenient sharing boxes or movie boxes. So easy to share or try. So it looks like there's a little bit of a coating on at least one of the items in here. So if you're a fan of Jet Puffed or just marshmallows in general, this might be something different to try for alongside your favourite TV show or movie. Sounds good? Perfect. If you do come back to visit us, let us know how that one is. I've been very interested to see what that one is like. Okay, so you'd like to see the seller's product? Perfect. So you're familiar with the brand? Perfect. Okay. So normally Seller's products come in those lovely little rounded chocolates and they're full of cherry juice. But this one is a little different, as you can tell. So this one has a little bit more of a cream to the product, as opposed to a whole cherry and liquid. This has a very luscious, beautiful flavour to it. And it comes in these convenient little packaged squares for you to eat at your convenience. If you were doing something for the holidays, they would be great as little stocking stuffers, perhaps. So, it says here, Taste the difference. Cellar squares are a delicious combination of rich milk chocolate and a smooth, creamy, cherry-flavoured filling made with the same care and experience used to craft our confections since 1864. This is a nice hefty bag. You get quite a few squares inside this. It's 224 grams. The packaging is simple. Very pretty. 
And what do you think about this one, as opposed to the typical Stella chocolates? Nice, isn't it? Yeah. I love both products, it just depends on which one I'm in the mood for. I find that this flavour is a little bit more delicate than the traditional Stella's chocolates. This is also peanut free and gluten free. What do you think about this one? You'll take this? Fantastic. Okay, let me just pop this to the side. Perfect. So how are the choices so far? Okay, good. So we're on the right track. Okay, perfect. Okay, so let's have a look at this one. So this is the Cadbury Dairy Milk Rum and Raisin chocolate bar. So, are you a fan of Cadbury? Okay. So this is a really nice slim bar. Cadbury can sometimes make smaller bars than this, or larger bars than this, but I think this is a really nice bar. Um, it's very conveniently sized, great for sharing. So, have you had the rum and raisin flavour? Okay, so rum and raisin is a very typical pairing of flavours in chocolate. Not usually for Cadbury, but this is a product that they've released with that. Now, I've not tried this one myself, but I will say that I think this is a great bet because Cadbury's chocolate is very smooth, high quality, and melt in the mouth. It's not too rich. And I think paired with such strong flavours like rum and raisin, it will balance all of that out really nicely. So I'll tell you a little bit about what it says on the back. By choosing Cadbury Dairy Milk, you've helped support cocoa farmers. Cocoa life helps farmers get the most from their cocoa trees through environmentally friendly farming, 100% sustainably sourced cocoa, we believe that tasting good and doing good goes hand in hand. So, what do you think about rum and raisin, usually? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, do you want to give this one a try? Okay. Alright, I'll just pop that on the side. There we go. Alright, would you like to have a look at some more? Perfect. Let's see, so we have a couple of seasonal clearance items. So this one is a cookie, if you're interested. This is by Foxes. This is the Fox's Creams Seasonal Edition in the flavour Sticky Toffee Pudding. Now our store has stocked Fox's products before. Have you had a chance to try them? Okay, so the cookie or the biscuit of this one is very similar to the usual Fox's products, but the Makeup of this one specifically, the creams or these crunchier styles. It's a little crunchier, a little bit more robust, as opposed to the chocolate foxes biscuits, were a little bit more um, crumbly, a little bit more delicate. Cookies of this one are a little tougher, not quite as tough as something like a ginger cookie, ginger snap, but a little thicker. And these have much more of a buttery flavouring to them. The cream in the middle tastes exactly like that, just cream. And it's a very buttery, creamy flavour. I've not had the opportunity to try these ones yet, but Sticky Toffee Pudding is a very classic holiday flavour. And I will say, if you're looking to try a cookie out of the usual, definitely suggest Fox's Creams. 
for me they are preferred over something like shortbread shortbread is a little bit more dense crumbly quite a plain flavor fox's creams have a lot of really interesting flavors to them very buttery creamy sugary and almost what feels like a brown sugar flavoring to it a little just a little bit more layered overall so the way this works is there are individual biscuits or cookies throughout and they are kind of like an oreo in the fact that the cream is sandwiched right in the middle of these cookies so having a look at the ingredients i can't spot brown sugar initially but to me it does have that flavor to it quite rich slightly buttery in that regard just really really nice a lot of lovely flavors going on not too rich not too bold just a really nice interesting take on a cookie lots of texture to keep it interesting too so what do you think how does this one sound perfect let me just pop that to the side all right wanted to have a look at the fruit salads of course they're right here just grab those there we go okay so the fruit salads that you tried are from a brand called barrett's and barrett makes a lot of different products they make something called blackjacks, which is an aniseed flavored licorice sweet. But the fruit salad is a combination of raspberry and peach, so really lovely, just juicy flavor. So this is the bag that they come in, and I'll just grab one of these now. This is a bite-sized sort of sweet. And they are all individually wrapped. These are 175 grams in total. And it says, experience the tongue-twisting world of Barrett. For over 150 years, we've been creating fun, wonder, and excitement. So go on, discover your favorite, and make sweet so there's no artificial colors and flavors and it's suitable for vegetarians but this is just a nice juicy fruity classic slightly hard sweet it's not a boiled candy as you've already experienced just more of a chewy sweet i've always come in this really fun packaging this yellow and pink packaging with a really fun font on the front so what do you think about these? perfect, okay so I'll just pop them there alright, would you like to have a look at some crisps? okay, perfect I have couple of new products in. Well, they're new to our store, but these have certainly been around for a very long time. I have in store right now the cheese and onion and salt and vinegar flavors of hula hoops. Now are you familiar with these? Okay, so these are a hoop shaped crisp packed full of flavor. These really do taste like what they describe. They taste of cheese and onion. The onion flavor is a little stronger in this than the cheese. Now these also use maize flour, so that kind of helps enhance those other flavors. So when you bite into these, these are a little bit sharp and they are covered in that wonderful flavoring. 
They just have a really nice, yummy potato, cheese, and onion flavor to them. They do have lots of lovely flavors inside the cheese and onion used on this. So you're going to get quite a layered, flavored experience. This is a 34 gram bag. So great to take on the go with you if you're looking for a snack. It says on the back, the original hula hoop, deliciously crunchy in our classic tasty flavors. And I'll show you the salt and vinegar. Same thing, but the salt and vinegar on this is very sharp. This has a very strong salt and vinegar flavoring to it. British crisps tend to flavor salt and vinegar very strongly, and it's done very, very well. I would definitely say this has just as much salt as it does vinegar to it, so you're going to get quite a kick from this if you're not already used to salt and vinegar snacks. Now this one's in the pretty blue packaging, and the other one is in the lovely green packaging. So, would you like either of these? Would you like to try both? Perfect. They're a great size, too, to try, so if you don't happen to like them, you're not wasting too much. Okay. So, you'd like to have a look at the Mini X? Okay, perfect. So, those eggs are Smarties by Nestle's take on, I believe it's Cadbury that makes the other Mini Eggs. This is Smarties Mini Eggs. What did you think of those? Yeah, they have a little bit of a um, slightly dense but more ganache focused flavor to them. Yeah, so as you'll have noticed, the shells don't have much of a flavor difference to them, they're all about the same. Now, with their chocolate, I find that it tastes a little less melt-in-the-mouth, a little bit more waxy. There is a notable flavor difference between um, most Nestle chocolate and most Cadbury chocolate. It just depends on what you're in the mood for. So the shell on these is a little bit more, has a little bit more of a sheen to it, as opposed to um, Cadbury mini eggs, which have a little bit more of a pastel finish to them, and it's almost flowery on the shell. But these are a little bit more solid and robust. Though the interior is quite similar with that uh, ganache, almost texture. So these come in this small handy bag, and these are paper package, which is quite nice, helps with recycling. Also has a nice texture to the bag. I was just looking for the weight. There we go. This is 80 grams, so this is a nice size for yourself or to share. And they're full of lovely coloured eggs, so they're nice and pretty. As you saw, there was orange, yellow, and blue. I think there might be some more colours inside. I've tried these myself and they do have that nice ganache flavour to them. So, what do you think about this? If you like to try this, fantastic. Just a nice different take to the Cadbury version of these, especially if you're looking to try something new. like to keep looking? Of course, I have plenty for you to have a look at. Let's see, what shall we have a look at? Let's have a look at this. So 
this is a new product to our store. This is by a company, I'm not sure how to pronounce, Kyoria. And this is their mochi custard. Now we do have this in two flavours. This is just the flavour that we have in the front right now. This is their raspberry mochi custard. This is six pieces and it is custard wrapped in a sweet rice dough. This is made in Taiwan. So, are you familiar with mochi? Mm-hmm. So, this seems like this would be quite a nice flavour to complement with the exterior here. This comes in a beautiful package, this nice beautiful pink with these other shades here. With the raspberry illustration on the front. Now this is 168 grams in total for the six pieces. Now, having a look at the back here, this contains some raspberry powder, skim milk powder, some white chocolate, and some other ingredients throughout. This is just another fun item that we have in stock right now. I wanted to suggest this to you. What do you think about this one? Sounds good? Perfect. I'll pop this to the side for you. And I'll bag all of this up at the end for you so that's nice and compact. Okay, so did you want to have a look at anything else from the plate? The high tube? No problem. So did you get a chance to try both? Okay, good. And what did you think of the flavours? They're nice, aren't they? Yeah. My favourite has to be the rainbow sherbet. It just has this nice, gentle, sugary flavour to it. It's always very difficult to describe the flavour of sherbet. Slightly how would you say? Frothy, almost? Now the blue raspberry has a nice flavour to it, it's a little strong for my taste, but the rainbow sherbet happens to be one of my favourites out of the Haichu flavours. So this is the fantasy mix, so this will come with both sweets in it. This one here is the blue raspberry, this has the white interior with the blue exterior and to the side they have the, it looks almost like a green interior, the pink exterior. And that is to have a double layer of flavour. Now this does contain real raspberry juice in the product as well as some lemon juice for additional flavour. This is a gluten-free product and it is 55 grams in total and it is conveniently packaged for you to have small little snacks at your convenience. So what do you think about this one? Great! I know you're familiar with Haichu products? I love the packaging of this one. The rainbow sherbet is just a really nice, interesting flavour that we don't see a lot of these days in sweets. Blue raspberry, definitely. It says immensely juicy, intensely chewy candy, high chew fantasy mix. I love that colour combo. It's almost like fluffy clouds and stars at the top, and the colour is just beautifully blend into one another. Really nice, fun packaging. Great as a gift for someone. Perfect. Alright, pop that to the side. 
I'm so glad you found so many items of interest today. Let's see. Let's have a look at this. So this is another seasonal clearance item that we have right now. This is our Cadbury Mini Snowballs Chocolate Bar. So this is a standard Cadbury Dairy Milk Chocolate Bar with micro mini snowballs pieces. So snowballs are a pretty popular snack seasonally for Cadbury, but what they've done is they've fused that into this bar. So the best way to describe a snowball, you've not had it, okay, is like a mini egg almost. It's the same exterior, that sort of shard-like candy. You can see it's broken and it has that really nice creamy ganache in the middle. So as you can see here, there's a little bit of shell and a little bit of ganache. And this is very typical for Cadbury to make flavour combinations for using other popular products in them. So for this one specifically, they've used snowballs. So you're going to get that beautiful, classic, melt-in-the-mouth Cadbury flavour. And it's going to be paired with that really nice, lovely ganache flavouring inside. Beautiful packaging. This has these little snowflakes on it. I just let you know that this was a winter product or a holiday product. So what do you think about this one? Sounds nice? Good. This will be a little bit different to the Smarties product, just because this is Cadbury's take on sort of like a mini egg. see what else we have. Like to have a look at the beans? No problem. So the beans come in these small bags. We have the holiday favourites and the cocktail classics. So you had a few samples on your plate from both. Looking at my sample plates here, I'd say you had the cranberry, hot chocolate, that's gin and tonic, mimosa, candy cane, I think. Okay, so I'll let you have a look at these two. So the cocktail classics, I believe, don't contain any alcohol. Just confirm. Just want to make sure for you. I don't see anything in regards to alcohol in the ingredients. Okay, so starting with the holiday favourites. This is a seasonal item from us. So this contains cranberry sauce, jelly bean, candy cane, pumpkin pie, eggnog, and hot chocolate. So did you think that from the flavours you tried, they hit the mark with those flavours? Yeah, I think so too. The candy cane has a really strong, minty, refreshing flavour to it. It's difficult to quite replicate the cranberry sauce, but I think they made a really great attempt and made it nice and fruity and berry-like. The eggnog is very much um, similar to your classic eggnog flavour. Has a lot of lovely nutmeg infused into it. Pumpkin pie also has a lot of nice spices in it. And the hot chocolate is also has that lovely cocoa flavour to it. So this comes in a nice convenient little bag, great for movie night. This is 28 grams. Comes in this green packaging with the jelly bean with their bag of beans here these beautiful illustrations on the front to help display what they're trying to achieve with the products. So 
So you have a left key here at the front, sorry, at the back. You can see what the beams are here. But you have a more thorough look so you can make a decision. You take this, perfect. Do you want to have a look at the cocktail one? Okay. So this one is not a seasonal item, it's just something that we sell all year round. And this is Jelly Belly's cocktail collection. So it looks like you tried the gin and tonic and mimosa. Now, how close do you think they were? Pretty close. Yeah, I happen to think the mimosa is very close. So it contains gin and tonic, margarita, mimosa, mojito, Moscow mule, pomegranate cosmo, pina colada, and a strawberry daiquiri sweet. And it does specifically say they're non-alcoholic, which I think is quite impressive considering they do taste quite strong. These are definitely not um, gently flavoured sweets. They're quite authentic in the flavours that they are hoping to achieve. Um, this is also 28 grams, great to sample, give it a try, so what do you think? You'll take this, perfect, pop that there for now, would you like to have a look at anything else? Okay, alright, so we do have these, these are not new but they are new to our store. These are a box of Raffaello's. Now, have you ever had these? Okay, so typically these are sold alongside Ferrero chocolates. Now, I believe that these are a coconut product. Yeah, they're an almond coconut treat. So, you can see, it looks like they have a little bit of desiccated coconut on exterior there, they're quite fluffy looking, very pretty, but they're all individually wrapped inside this box, great as a gift for somebody, and you can actually see because they have semi-transparent packaging, you can see that they're a Ferrero product, and you can see what the product looks like without having to open it. So this is a really nice, elegant box using Raffaello's typical colours of white and red to advertise their brand. So this contains dry coconut and almonds as some of the ingredients in the product. Of course, you can have a look. So this is a 150 gram box. And the main flavours here are just almond and coconut. Really nice a gift or something for yourself. And they open at the top here. Okay, perfect. Pop that to the side. Okay, so would you like to have a look at anything else? A couple things? Okay. Let's see what we've got. be nice. So this is another seasonal product that we have. This is by Lent. Are you familiar with their chocolate? Okay, so they make all sorts of chocolates. They make truffles, they make things for Easter like bunnies, they make milk chocolate Santa Claus bunnies, they make white chocolate and strawberry bunnies. They make strawberry chocolate bars, blueberry chocolate bars, all sorts of lovely products. I think there's probably a blend product for everybody out there. So this is the alcoholic flavoured chocolate range. They do make a few, including this one which is Rum Punch, but they also make an apricot alcohol infused bar, as well as an orange liqueur flavour which is lovely. 
So the way that this works is these are set in a bar but they have these individual pieces here and it sort of has a hump here Now inside the hump is the uh, rum flavouring so it's going to be a liquid inside this little shell here So you're going to get quite a nice rich flavour to this one now, I am unable to find the specific ingredients for you in this one um, as this is in German so I think we'll just have to have a look at the frontier to determine if you like this so there appears to be a little bit of orange perhaps cinnamon here but the texture experience is very unique Unlike other chocolates, which experiment more with solids, this is unique because it works with liquids paired with solid chocolate. But also, it comes down to if you like the flavour of rum punch or lead chocolate. What do you think? You like this one? Fantastic. Give this a go and let me know what you think we do have other flavors that we will be stocking in the future perfect so you like to have a look at one more of course so let's see i'll let you decide would you like to have a look at a hard boiled sweet some cookies or a chocolate assortment chocolate assortment perfect so this is a collection of Ritter Sport chocolates this is a German brand are you familiar with this? okay so this is a sample sizing of some of their popular flavors you get eight pieces inside some are doubles but it will contain one cornflake chocolate two alpine milk chocolates two milk chocolate with butter biscuit and cocoa creams we do also have a full size of some of these if you're interested okay we have one dark chocolate with marzipan filling one milk chocolate with chopped hazelnuts and one milk chocolate with praline filling so Ritter Sports is one of my favourite chocolates because they really pack the chocolate full of the ingredients labelled and yet they still find a way to not make the ingredients that are inside it overpowering it always perfectly complements the beautiful buttery melt-in-the-mouth chocolate that Ritter Sport uses this makes for a fantastic gift but it's also a great entry point into trying a variety of different Ritter Sport chocolates without committing to a full size bar so the total weight of this product is 133 grams and you can see all of the flavors inside beautifully decorated with shades of blue, green, brown, red, yellow, and a deeper blue. They're very striking and these colors just really draw you in to the product overall. So what do you think about this product as well as these flavors? Sounds good? Perfect. That there. So, is that everything? Okay, perfect. So, what I'll do now is I'll bring all of these items to the counter and I'll bag them up for you and you can pay whenever you're ready, okay? Okay. Well, thank you so much for shopping with us. I really hope that you enjoy these snacks. And we hope to see you again soon.
Take care. Goodbye.